Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. How you guys doing? I'm your host Anna and my channel name is... Now I heard a couple y'all, only my dreams girl, only my dreams, we know baby. Thank you so much for coming by to visit. I really appreciate it. I know it's been like a minute, right? It's been a while since I've done anything Dollar Tree. So I finally got out of the house today by myself. Woo, 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 woo. Yeah, by myself, baby. Because my kids are on spring break. So it was a much deserved half of an hour <laughs> that I really and truly needed. Um, so let me show you the stuff that I found. Um, let's start off with the books since I only got two books. Um, this first one is called Paul Star on Beauty, Conversations with 30 Celebrity Women. Now, this book retails for $24.95. $24.95. And it's a nice big hardback book, a great gift table conversation book. You know, if you're a bookie like me, you like to have different sorts of things to look at. Um really nice book and it has some actresses that I want to say at least one actress is no longer with us and that's the reason I got it um because she was in there and I really like her and they talk and they, and they have information let me see if I can find it's very beautiful look look at that oh, I'm trying to tell you I'm trying to tell you, honey. Let me see if I can find. I think it's Brittany Murphy. She's no longer with us. She's passed away. But yeah, she's in here. Brittany Murphy. That's one of the reasons why I got this book. Because I really enjoyed her when she was here with us. Um, she passed away many years ago. Many years ago. And she was an amazing actress. So I wanted to get the book. The next one I found was this one. And it's called Rome. Okay. And this is HBO Rome, the show. And this retails for $30 US. As you can tell, it's a nice big book. And this is beautiful blue with this gilded gold. Really pretty hardback book. And then you see all the stuff from the show. You see all the stuff. You see that from the show? Some really cool scenes. Okay, so they have that there again. This is a great one for those who like to watch different types of um, genres. Great gift idea or just for your own um, personal book collection. Now let's talk about food really quick because I don't have that much food to share. They, I found the Dunkaroos. They didn't have any more. Then they came back with them. So they had some, I bought two more boxes of the General Mills Dunkaroos. This is a really good brand. My kids really enjoy this. And for $1.25, you can't beat it. It's 11.3 ounce. I think I saw the Frosted Flakes um, cereal with the cinnamon balls, but we still had like two or three boxes of those. So I didn't get that. Um, I picked up two bags of the Jolly Time Yellow Popcorn. This comes in a one pound, four ounce bag. This is a great prepper item to have. If you're gonna store this, do not put oxygen absorbers with this. You need this to be able to pop and it needs the moisture to pop. So all you have to do to keep this safe, put it in a glass jar somewhere, cool, dark place, and make sure you know there no moisture can get in. And this will last you almost indefinitely. Um, and it only takes just a little bit of oil or a little bit of butter either in a bag in a microwave or in a pot, and you can have some popcorn very quickly. So this is a great thing to have. Then they um, brought in the caramelized biscuits by Pally. I wanna say Polly or Pally. And um, these are actually really good. These are small biscuits, lightly spiced with a unique taste. It is an 8.8 .8 ounce and I want to, they're from the Netherlands, okay? So these are from the Netherlands, and they are upside down, and I've had these before. They are very, very, very good. They do have a nice spice taste with the caramel, so it's, it's um, a stronger type of a biscuit, but it's still very good. Um, this would be great with tea or with coffee or something like that. My kids really enjoyed it, so it was nice to see that it came back. 
it has a good flavor, like a good robust flavor. It's not lightly seasoned. Okay, then they had the Lance Nakat sandwich cookies, the lemon cream. So my boys really like this. I like it too. Normally you see them there and they're not in the box. I prefer when they're in the box. So you get six four packs. So you got six four packs. I did get two of the Jolly Time, two of the six four pack. Then I did get some Weiler's um, sugar-free pink lemonade for myself because I'm drinking a lot of water right now. <laughs> and then I was really surprised to see they had Harry and David. Yes, I said Harry and David. Harry and David, honey, they have it there. Look at that. Harry and David, this is a great time to pick these up, tuck them away for gifts. Um, the best buy day for these are all the way out until April of 2023. So you could do that and tuck them away and it looks like you spent some money and you gave some thought to it, you know? Gosh, my hair is a mess. And not nobody here is saying anything. Nobody's saying, hey girl, fix your... Nobody's saying nothing. What's wrong with y'all? Okay. So the Harry David wafer rolls. Delicately crisp and creamy hazelnut. 2.5 ounce. And then the other is the delicate, crisp, creamy chocolate. So these are the only two flavors that they had. Chocolate and hazelnut. I was like, well, let's give them a go. Let's see what they taste like. Now, um, the last foodie item, I got several bags of the Eat Regal Jasmine Rice. We really like this. This is a great way to get some rice, 90 seconds, bing, bang, boom, you add your own spices and then you throw some beans if you have some leftover, you know, proteins or whatever, boom, you're done. Or you can even heat this up, throw it into a pot of um, soup or something because you need to bulk it up. Simple, 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 really easy, especially if you're having kind of rough days like me. I'm having my bad days and my good days. As far as pain, you want ease. Um, so I did pick up several of these and the best buy dates for these are June of 2023. And they're good. Jasmine rice is good. Now, I saw a lot of you sharing this. And I found them. So this is the Flame Glow Realistic Flame Light um, Solar Steak Light. Lasts up to eight hours. And I picked up six because I thought that they were so pretty. I thought they were so pretty. And I, you know, I did press a little button there. I know it says here you have to remove before using here um so i guess you gotta oh, okay there we go now see if i block it you can see the light so it is solar that's why i'm blocking it so the light will turn on so think about it this would be a nice one to have not only outdoors but indoors in case you lose electricity and you, you could put this inside of a ball jar or any container or even inside of a plant or a small pot with, with um, you know, beads, uh, dirt, whatever you have. And you just stick it in and it gives you a little ambient lighting. Let's people know you put it at the window. Let's people know you're in there. Um, so, yeah, that was a cool thing to find. So I got, like I said, six of those. Then... Um, I saw my store in the Waldorf area, the one next to Rainbow, has all of their ocean beach theme goodies. They do. They got them out. They have them all out. And they have a lot of really cool items. And I kind of had to stop myself because I don't have a beach theme in my house. I don't. I'm more country, rustic country, as you could tell. Look at all the metal and the baskets that's that's my theme here um but i thought about maybe changing up a theme in the boys room possibly ocean theme would be a pretty cool one to do so um i'm wrapping my head around it but i did buy this tag because i wanted to put some of the rope the dollar tree rope around here i thought it would give it more of a boost the nautical boost and it would be a nice thing to see in their room just in time get back to the store with a little bit of time and think like what do I want to buy strategically to make the room look kind of cool you know so yeah I bought this one just to share with you that they got all the nautical stuff out you know who's sharing all the nautical stuff my cousin 
case for Karen. She's my prima. We're family. She was sharing a whole bunch of the nautical stuff, and she shared this one. And I was like, oh my gosh, I can't wait till I can get to the Dollar Tree. Girl. But let me show you the other little things that I got from, not the nautical, but like the beach theme section, I should say. They had the plates and all the really cool stuff they do. They have them all. Um, but this is just a shell-shaped dish. And I thought these were absolutely gorgeous. Do you see the rainbow effect on this thing? Ah, and it is concave, so it does have a little structure to it. And if you feel it, you can feel the lines on this and everything. So pretty. So, so pretty. So I could easily see me putting this if I wanted to do, you know, a little vignette or something up against the wall, some candle right, right in front of it or something. It'll look really cool, but I really bought it just for my craft room so I could put stuff inside and I have this really pretty um, rainbow effect while I'm holding my things because I just like this kind of stuff. Isn't that beautiful? Ah, the little things in life that bring us so much joy and pleasure. I'm telling you. All right, then I did want to redo my front um, wreath. I already showed you guys my DIY Dollar Tree um, front porch makeover when I changed out the whole look of this big, huge pot. It's making such a big difference when you walk into the house. That's the first thing you see as soon as you walk in. It looks gorgeous. No must, no fuss. No bees, no problems. They're fake flowers. I don't have to water them. Bill is happy. My bill is happy. You know, we don't have a big water bill now. Yeah, less watering. But I saw these. Now, these are the bikini tops. This is actually made to go and cover, you know, the girls. But I wanted to use this to put on my, because it's so big, it looks like a big, huge shell on my wreath. Yeah, I thought it would be a great idea to put it on my wreath. Now, I also thought... If I wanted to add more dramatics, let's open this up together really quick so you could just see it. Because these are plastic, okay? You see how it goes like that? I would just cut that stuff off, the string, because it's supposed to go like this. <laughs> We're not going to do it like that. I would just take all these strings off and what have you, just like I'm doing right now. I can't take off that one because I have to cut that one, but you see how it would look. Oh, thank you, Noah. Noah just gave me some scissors. Thank you, Bubba. Yeah, because I'm not going to use these strings. I don't know if you can use that string for something. Because I did buy them the pool noodles because Noah likes to build stuff with a pool noodle. There's some string in case you need some. These two little bits we could just throw away. So this is what it looks like. Now, I also thought about using one of these hot glue and nests, attaching it to that, and putting it on, you know, a wreath. To make it look really pretty to do a whole theme i don't know i was thinking about it but this was definitely for the wreath i thought these were so cool looking look at that all right enough enough talk about that one let's do beach beach uh all right so they had the stirrers and uh, i do drink coffee every day and sometimes it's just fun to be able to stir your coffee with some pink flamingos i thought those were cute and they're nice and bright. If you see them in person, they're really nice and bright. They actually are almost like fluorescent. They're really nice. I like that. Then um, I did pick up the stirrers. Okay. Again, sometimes we have to stir our drinks. So there are some pineapple stirrers. They're like little spoons. You see that? And they got the pineapple. How cute is that? And they had it like the cacti. <laughs> <laughs> that is so cute it's so much fun so these are going to be some fun stirrers to use whenever we need to stir our drinks or something you know then i bought these for my car um these are the kismos 12 count reusable straws i don't like paper straws they're horrible i think they change the taste of any drink that we buy anywhere and they give you a paper straw it's gross i like sorry straws regular old straws but these are reusable so you know there we go i got those from my car they are bpa free 
Then I always pick up a lighter. This is a great prepper item to always have, so I always like to pick up a lighter whenever I go. Then they had the area where they had um, the Fiesta, the Fiesta theme. So I only picked up two things for the Fiesta theme. I got these little mini hats so my boys can maybe make something, but I also thought about if I wanted to do a, a, um, a little fun um, wreath, you can use these little hats on a wreath too. And you can even change out that little middle paper part because it's just paper, you know? But look, isn't that a cool idea? So many things you can do, right? This is for you guys, so you can play with it. Then um, I got these um, Let's Fiesta napkins. I did, this is my second set. It is the avocado. You guys, these are so thick and good quality. They're 16. If you cut these, you will have double the amount because these are so thick. Honestly, look, I'm gonna show you. These are so thick that you can make these extend out. They're so cool looking. And if you're doing any paper napkin projects, hello, you need a set of these, okay? These are so nice and thick, all you have to do is cut them right here. Right there, at that line, boom, 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 boom. Takes two seconds, okay? Then you still have, you know, a nice thick napkin, because it's two, it's a two ply. But now you have more. Think about doing that just to extend out what you have. That's what I like to do. Then, um, did I show you my stir sticks with the palm trees? Yeah, I got stir sticks with the palm trees too because I thought they were absolutely gorgeous. Now, when you see these in person and you look at them through the light, they're like fluorescent. They're not, they're not really truly showing that right here on the, on the screen. It's not, but it is, and you're going to love it. I'm trying to tell you, you're going to love it. Now, they did bring back these really cool lights, the LED hanging lamp. Now, I only picked up one. I only picked up one. I know this was like a hot selling item. I don't want to say last year, that was it the year before? One of y'all gonna tell me. Uh, but it is a cool item to have if you like to hang things, the lights up. As you can see, it does light up. And it is LED, okay? So I got one of those. Then um, they had the two pack of these cups. And these cups are so stinking cute with the fresh fruit. And then it has lids. Yeah, I know. And they're, they're thin plastic. So they're not going to last you like a really long time. And I just I had to have it for me. For me. I had to have it for me. Just had to do it. Hmm. Now, back, I almost forgot. <laughs> Back to the nautical thing. They have these and they have them in different, like three different themes. I only got one. This is the Shore Living Wood, Be Wood Bead Garland. Now the reason why I picked up this one is because it has this right here. That right there. Because I can paint this and put that on dollhouse furniture in like a little boy's room. I do have a, um, a lighthouse, dollhouse that is a lighthouse downstairs that I have to bring upstairs eventually. And I can use that in there for some decor and what have you. So I had to get it. And then all these little wood beads we can use and I can use to build stuff for dollhouse miniatures and what have you. So it'll never go to waste. Now I was really excited to see that they had, well, before I show you the toothpaste, they had the Dove Pink with Deep Moisture. Um, ah, this smells so good. Uh, soap. And this smells so good. It, the smell is so vibrant and strong. This is the kind of soap that you could take, split it in half, cut it in like three ways, and tuck it into your, um, into like your underwear drawer, your sock drawer, and it'll make everything smell really good. My mom used to put soap, sachets, anything she had to smell really good, she'd put it in a drawer and it'd make all her stuff smell good. Yeah. That's what my mom used to do, and I thought of that. Oh, as soon as I smelled this, I thought of that immediately. Oh, because it smells so good. So when you guys get a chance, even if you don't want to buy it, just stop and just smell it. It smells so good. Okay. Um, then I did buy. I'm not gonna show you. I'm not gonna show you the wipes because you guys have seen below our wipes. I'm not gonna show you my tissues. I'm not gonna do that. 
but I did get um, some more tooth toothbrushes. It's really important that we have enough toothbrushes. This is a three pack of the Colgate Soft. And then I really like the placards because um, they have like a really cool, a cool design on there, which you can really feel on your teeth as you're brushing them. So this is called the Plackers Ultra Ultra White in Medium. Okay. And these work out really well. So I got two of those. Because your teeth your hygiene, your teeth hygiene is really important. Then bum ba da ba. You guys remember when everybody found the Colgate Renewal in the green. This was um, the Revitalizes Gums in the green. Okay? Enamel Fortify. This was the one everybody found. Enamel Fortify. This goes for $9 and some change, sometimes 10 and up. It just depends on where you go. I buy this on a regular and it ain't cheap. It's not cheap. So, you know, I got, you know, a handful of these and tucked them away. Today, I found the blue. <laughs> I was like, oh my gosh. If they bring the whole line to the Dollar Tree, I'm going to lose my mind. They have the blue. The blue is the whitening restoration. Okay? So, if you are a fan of this Colgate line, and you know it's expensive, you know it's effective, you know it works, your mouth likes it, your teeth likes it, your gums enjoy it. They have it there for $1.25. Get a coupon, honey. Oh, the deal. The deal. So there you have it. So I bought seven, seven of these for my family. The best buy date for these are 11 of 23. So the end of next year. Not this year, but the end of next year. Plenty of time to use it because we go through toothpaste. Bless you. Now, the other toothpaste I was able to find is this. You see this? Yeah, You no. Do you see this? This is the full size. Full size. This <laughs> is, bless you, 4.4 ounce Colgate Maximum Cavity Protection Mild Bubble Fruit. This is going to be amazing. I did buy eight because my kids go through some toothpaste like no one's business. I love the fact that it has this right here to keep it from going crazy. Just one little pump, boop, you're good to go. It's not going to be all over the place. I'm going to have to clean it off from the walls, from the sink, from the side of the thing. Toothpaste gets everywhere. Yeah, it's like a toothpaste nightmare. But... I can't wait for them to try this and it is full size crazy so if you want to save some money get some quality products look for these toothbrush this um, toothpaste right now they have a full size save yourself some money get it into your house and get get a year's worth how much do you use get a year's worth so you're good to go no matter what happens that's the last thing you have to think about okay so there you have it. Yay! Because you know whenever you find stuff like that, you blink and it's gone. So if you don't get it, you're going to sleep on it. You're not going to find it again. Thank you so much for coming by. I will talk to you guys later and have a lot more to share with you. So make sure you come back. Bye.